Hey Felix Gamers, it's the Wild Card with another quick tip. And this quick tip is going to be on the use of poster tack, also known as blue tack. I've seen it in different colors, white and green and stuff like that, but really the most I've seen it was always as blue tack. But if you, nobody knows what it's called by blue tack, you may be able to get help in finding it when you call it poster tack. Uh, you'll find it if you're in an office supply store, you're going to find it there. But if you're in kind of a big box store type of thing, go to the office section and you'll be able to find poster tag. It's meant for hanging posters on walls uh, type of deal. And this is great for our hobby. You can see I have it on an old paint pot. Now this is way too much poster tag. I mean, not that it's hurting anything, but you don't need this much on there. Um, what it's good for is holding things while you're painting it. It can get paint on it and it'll still work. It doesn't dry out, so you don't have to worry about storing it, uh, especially. It's just there to hold something, like a base, let's say. Normally I have a model on here, you put the base, or the, you know, you can put the base on here and then glue a model down on it, type of deal. If this was a bit I was actually painting, I could put it in like that and, you know, paint a little bit. Um, you can also hold whatever, like if this was a long stick holding a bit on it, you can do that and then paint, whatever. This is a, a completed model, just to show you that how it kind of works. You would have this on there and basically getting ready to paint it, doing whatever. See, it holds it pretty well. It also works great with airbrushing. People use this a lot, actually. I've seen it primarily on top of like a long cork. This is a bit short. I mean, it works just fine, but typically somebody will get like a wine cork or whatever, which is a little bit longer, or some other type of cork, which is long, just to get a better feel, a better grasp of, of the uh, handle as it basically becomes. So your hand's no longer on the piece you're painting, which is good because our hand is oily by nature. And you could smudge and smear paint if you're uh, actively painting while holding it potentially by trying to maneuver the model to paint it. So why do that when you can get some post attack? It's pretty cheap. One packet will last you just fine. Uh, you'll find it probably in a small pack or a deluxe pack. If you want to make multiple of these, let's say you're going to have, um, you're going to paint up a mini squad of five or something like that, then the deluxe pack will work because it has enough definitely to do five. I have enough on here to do two easily. So and this is just one thing. So. Um, yeah, give it a shot if you never thought of using post attack. It's a nice way to hold models, hold bits, or whatever it is while you're painting it. Because, like I said, you don't want to hold it by hand. And even if you had a model on a base, holding the base still, you know, there's no model on here, but just pretend. You know, I'm holding the base. I'm still kind of in the way. I can't really angle it too well. But when the base is on here, I can do a whole bunch of angles. Once again, demonstrating it with this completed model here. You know, put it down on there, very easy, very quick, and then I can maneuver it, do whatever I want. My hand holding it is out of the way, so I have a lot more room to get in there with my paintbrush and paint things. So, that's poster tack, also known as blue tack. Give it a shot if you haven't tried it yet. This really is a good way to hold things while you're painting. It can also work pretty well for holding things steady while gluing. Let's say you have two bits that you glued and you want to kind of hold it while it sets. You can kind of glue them, hold them, and push them in a little bit on the blue tack. you got to be a bit more careful that way, but it can also work for that regard. So pretty useful, definitely for painting, a little bit for assembly as well. Poster tack, available pretty much anywhere that sells office supplies. And that's it, Fearless Gamers. So if you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comment section. And until next time, this is the Wildcard saying, take it easy.